PowerPoint a lot to create images for training material. And sometimes I'll use it to answer questions that my online students might have. So I'll take a screenshot and then I like to use circles and rectangles and arrows to point to something within that screenshot to explain whatever it is I'm trying to explain. But in PowerPoint, when I insert a shape, the default that I get is not what I like to use. My shapes, I like to have a red outline that's a little bit thicker with no fill color. Let's take a look at how you can change that default shape to be the way that you want it to be and to always be that way. First thing I'm going to do is create a new shape in my presentation. PowerPoint will add the shape with the default style. Then I'm going to apply my formatting. So you can change the fill color, the style, the weight of a line. You can add an effect or make any other changes that you want to the shape that you want as your default. Now select the shape, right click the border, and then click set as default shape on the pop-up menu. Now this is only going to work for your current presentation. And if you want default shapes only for one presentation, this is the method to use. If you want your formatting to be permanent, you have to take one more step. Click the Design tab, click the More Down arrow at the right end of the Themes Gallery to expand the display of the available themes. Save Current Theme. Give the theme a name of your choosing. I named mine Screenshots. Now that theme is available in the Themes Gallery. Alright, so let's test this out. Close PowerPoint, now I'm going to open it back up, and I'm going to look for my custom theme. So I have a blank presentation, I have these other themes, I'm going to click on More Themes, and now I have Custom. Click on Custom, and here is my screenshots theme that I just saved. Create. And I'm going to go to a blank layout for presentation purposes. Insert. Shapes. Here's one of my go-to shapes. And look at that. Exactly like I had formatted and saved. If you didn't open your custom theme when you opened up PowerPoint, you can still switch themes once PowerPoint is open. Simply go to the Design tab, click the drop-down arrow for your themes, and under Custom, you'll see your custom theme. Click on that to open it, and now, there it is. The custom theme you created in PowerPoint is also available in Word, under Design, Themes, Custom Themes, and also Excel under Page Layout, Themes, and Custom Themes. Thank you for watching. You know, I was super jazzed when I discovered this time saver, so I hope you find it just as useful. If you like this video, please subscribe to my channel. And I think you're going to like this next video.